All right, so got some real talk here. Uh, was coming home, and on the side of the road, I saw um, somebody who had pulled over. Their lights were flashing. Um, I knew something was wrong that they weren't driving, but immediately start coming up with excuses of um, what if they're violent? What if I can't help them? What if I don't have what they need to help them? Maybe somebody else will help them. There's always people helping people on the side of the road. Mind immediately started going to excuses not to pull over and help. And I know I'm not the only one that's that's done this, but this is something that God has been working on with me, um, not coming up with excuses. When he says go, don't question it, just, just go, regardless of my fears or questionings. So I originally I passed them up, did a U-turn, did another U-turn, came back around. Thankfully, it ended up just being, uh, they just needed a lug nut removed, um, thankfully. But I feel like this situation applies to a lot of things. How many times has God asked us to do something specific, maybe something that's getting us out of our comfort zone, and we find some excuse, uh, great or small, to not go do it. Um, and so I'm thinking of, uh, in, in the book of Matthew, chapter 21, verse um, 28, and I'll just read from here. It says, this is Jesus speaking. He says, but what do you think about this? A man with two sons told the older boy, Son, go out and work in the vineyard today. The son answered, No, I won't go. But later he changed his mind and went away. Then the father told the other son, You go. And he said, Yes, sir, I will. But he didn't go. Which of the two obeyed his father? And they replied, The first. And I think in this age, God is, is teaching us not to pay lip service to him. He's not interested in what we're going to say. He's interested in what we're going to do. And how easy is it while we're, we're doing praise and worship or we're in a church service to say, Oh Lord, oh Lord, I'll go, I'll go, I'll do whatever you ask. But then we walk out unchanged. And I think God is interested and has always been interested in people who will go and do what he's asked them to do. God bless.